directed by debut and director Robbie Verghese Raj and written by Mohammad Shafi and Ronnie David Raj Kanu Squad starring Mamuti in the lead role is finally released on Disney Plus Hotstar as the Malayalam investigative thriller releases on the streaming platform we thought this would be the perfect time to discuss the real life references of the movie so that you can have the best viewing experience a spoiler warning is in order as we will be discussing essential plot points and character details from the movie but if you are done watching it already let's type street into the video and yeah while you're at it please like the video and subscribe to our channel it helps us a lot thank you and let's move on The film depicts real events that took place between 2007 and 2013. Ronnie David Raj and Mohammad Shafi, who wrote the story and screenplay of the film, approached the Kannur Squad officers in 2018. The Kannur Squad originated from Kannur and was influenced by the police unit known as the Kannur Squad, formed by ADGP S Srijit, the Kerala Transport Commissioner. He was SP in the district in 2008 selecting and training constables and officers as the crimes increased in Kannur and investigation unit was formed the team is still operational and consists of nine members led by additional SI Matthew Jose and senior CPO Rafi Ahmed MA Vinod Kumar P K Manoj Kumar C Sunil Kumar K Jarajan Rajesh Kariya Rajeshekar C K and SI Baby George during the interviews officers shared information about the various incidents they investigated The writer however was particularly interested in one situation that caught his attention as Srijit later meet Robbie Verghese and Ronnie David and Shafi during the post production stage According to a report published in On Manorama the most interesting assignment of the Kanu squad was to trace the two youths who killed a gulf businessman in Tirukkarippur police traveled more than 6000 kilometers in 16 days to catch the suspects the 58 year old ab abdul salam haji was killed at home on august 4 2013 the house was equipped with a state of the art security system including surveillance cameras remote control gates and sensor doors the gang however entered the house and tied up haji his wife and children They forced their victims to part with their gold ornaments before stabbing Haji to death. One of their relatives said to the police that the assailants spoke in Hindi. They planned the heist so well that they even destroyed surveillance cameras. However, one of them left his gloves behind. The sweat on the gloves provided DNA evidence that could prove invaluable in court. Investigator found SIM cards that had been activated on two cell phones in the area before the murder. The squad identified the owner of the SIM cards and the team arrested five suspects. The robbery and murder were planned by two people known to the victims and their families. They spoke in Hindi during the operation to mislead the investigators. Two other suspects handed over the documents to the police and told them that Asghar and Shihab fled to Kanpur, Uttar Pradesh and after that a friend helped them. The team traced them to Kanpur but they changed their mobile phones and started using landlines. Police covered the city for suspects posing as marriage brokers and workers. They then received information that the suspects were heading towards Allahabad on their way to Nepal. They both boarded a bus to Allahabad. The police however boarded a faster train to that place in time. They were waiting for Ashkar and Shihab at the bus stop. If the police had arrived 30 minutes later, the suspects would have crossed the border into Nepal safely. Both of them were flown back to Kerala the next day. Right now the original Kannu squad is defunct and its members are serving in various police departments. The film maintains a balance between a procedural story and a star-studded adventure. The second half of the film could have been more dramatic by cutting down the extended fight sequences, but we are not complaining as 72-year-old Mamuchi is still fit to deliver pop moments or fan service with ease. Of course, the star is also a legendary artist, so his usual casual acting style fits perfectly here. Moreover, the cinematic freedom that accompanies the action sequences does not detract from the tension of the proceedings. Ronnie David and Shafi's screenplay is heavily based on reality with great attention to detail although there are no major twists and turns it is interesting to see how the kanu squad overcomes all the obstacles with brains and agility to succeed in their mission all in all this is a great watch and is the perfect film for this weekend hey 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 thank you for watching this video do share your thoughts in the comment section about your experience of watching kanu squad on disney plus hotstar hit the like button and subscribe to our channel to get your weekly dose of cinema and series see you at the next one and for the timing we are signing off vida and i'll be back